Say it again. What's up, bitch? We're gonna cut that. We're gonna cut that. <laughs> Bonjour. Bonjour. Today we are at the Place de la République in Paris. We wanted to try croissant because it's Easter Sunday. Sunday is for croissant, but everything is closed. Just near the Place de la République, we have the Bouillon. It's one of the cheapest restaurants in Paris. Maybe the cheapest one to have like a full menu. So let's try it and see if it's worth the try. The Place de la République is really famous for the skater boys. And we are with Tiffany. Are you ready to eat? I'm ready, let's go, hurry up. You say that you used to do vlogs? Don't talk about that. Yeah? <laughs> Don't look for it. No vlogs at San Bernardino, I want to see that. You can already see that there is a line waiting for the Bouillon because it's a really popular restaurant. It's cheap and it's open all day long, every day. So you can try all the French classics at any time during the day. They have a famous a classic entree, the starter, the egg mayonnaise. And it's like the best selling item on Uber Eats. Like, why ordering it for delivery? You can do it at home. <laughs> why? Can you say of mayonnaise? <laughs> what? This is the name. Of mayonnaise? That's good. That's uh, pretty good. Uh, come on, come at me. Should she start a YouTube channel? Tell us in the comments. Mm. That looks nice. That looks really nice. Let's go. Donc, uh... Okay, we're inside the Bouillon Republic. It's really traditional, the French classic. You can find all the French classics. And the vibe is a bit oldy. I really like this vibe of the traditional restaurant. They have a big selection of the French classic. We have the entree, which is the starter. Then the main course called the plat, the cheese and the dessert here. And everything is really cheap. Like the entrée are about four euros. The main course are about 10, 12 euros. And the dessert about four or five. You can have a full meal for 20, 25 at maximum. And usually in the big brasserie, it costs maybe 20, 25 for just the main course. So it's really, really cheap. But is it good? We need to try it. What do you want to try? I'll have what he's having. <laughs> Is it a Harry Met Sally, uh, yeah. one Harry Met Sally reference? Yeah. You can find soup à l'oignon, the onion soup, sausage and mashed potatoes, the duck breast. I think I'm going to take the duck breast. Yeah. It's not really vegan. I think the fish sounds good, actually. You want to take the fish? I think so. What is it? The filet? That one? Yeah, the bar. It's the name of the fish in French, okay. the bar. And no wine with that because? Because we are... We're sober sisters. <laughs> It looks like a vlog from the 2010. Like, I love it! I love like, it so much! Usually the Bouillon Republic is a bit crowded because it's really famous, it's a popular uh, place. It's Sunday Easter, so I think many people on, for the Sunday Easter are with their family, with people from their blood, I don't know. <laughs> from <laughs> their, their blood? From their own bloodline. <laughs> and we are here. We're blood by Drinking choice. water. <laughs> family by choice. Family by choice. My mom gonna watch the video. Love, you, love your mom. To us what are, what are you saying? <laughs> First thing in a French restaurant is to taste the bread. This one looks looks okay, not the best, but a good one. We have the snails, the escargot with the beurre persillé, it's parsley and butter. And it's cooked with it and all the taste of the escargot comes from the butter and parsley. And this is the mushroom soup. It smells nice. Let's try it. <laughs> This is what I need. Let's go. Mm. Yeah. You have this taste, like this deep taste of, uh, of mushroom. This umami flavor, like the Japanese people say. Let's do it again. Let's go. Bon appétit. Mm. This is mine now. We need to try the beast. You need to take with this uh, little... Uh, what's the name of this Houston soul? I have no clue. You put the fork. In it. it looks a bit disgusting, but don't don't think of the texture. Don't, by don't watch it. Yeah, <laughs> like, it's so good. It's like unbelievable. Like she said, we are comedy food channel, and I think I want this for for this YouTube channel. Comedy food. That's the best. Wait, wait. I have the stain. The texture is chewy, like it's like octopus. And everything is about the sauce, like the parsley and butter. This is, this is so good. This is the duck breast with the potatoes and it looks wonderful. Look at that. Here we have the fish, the bar in French. Fish, mashed potatoes. Those are really simple food. It's classic, but it looks really nice. And the quantity is great for something that costs like 10, 10 to 12 bucks. It's pretty nice. So the duck breast is served with uh, orange sauce. 
with orange inside. And with the pomme sarladaise, it's a way to cook the, the potatoes cooked in duck fat. <laughs> Did you take uh, one of the potatoes? It wasn't me. You have the fish with this creamy sauce, mashed potatoes and spinach. <laughs> Isn't better than school cafeteria? Oh yeah. My school cafeteria, like, what, what, do, we, what do we even eat? Like, cardboard pizza? Like... <laughs> <laughs> The sauce looks a bit jelly. Oula. The sauce is a bit cold, but we wait to eat it, so maybe it's my fault. You have the garlic, the parsley. It's perfect. It's, comf it's comfort food. It's delicious. That looks so great. <laughs> Tell people how we met. I'm trying to remember because I thought it was from the camp. The camp uh, festival. Host. I've seen one of your comments. Oh, yeah. on one of my Cannes video when I visited Cannes you can see it on, on Instagram 300k <laughs> almost 1 million I've seen your comments on one of my videos talking about cinema I was like oh maybe maybe you're into cinema too I clicked on your profile and they say producer distributor I was like we need to talk we need to do something together and we became friends and now we eat food together on Easter Sunday. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> okay, Tiffany is showing me a vlog that she made for Easter, but 11 years ago. Show me, show me. Literally, like, oh my god. This is... It looks like archives, you know, home videos from the Y2K. Something from Richard Linklater <laughs> movie. It's oh in 2012? Yeah. Yeah. You were a YouTuber at that time. You need to start a, vlog, a vlogging channel. Oh my god, the before You guys. were so young. <laughs> before the guys break your heart. You're not wrong. <laughs> <laughs> before the trauma and after the trauma. You glowed up. I'm eating and I'm surprised how good it is. Because it's really cheap, it's affordable. Yeah. It's about 10 or 12 bucks mm -hmm. for the main course. That's good. And it's a plate that I could, I could eat in another restaurant and could cost like 23 euros, like twice the price. Bouillon Republic, really good bouillon in Paris. By the way, the name Bouillon, in French it means broth, and it's like the type of restaurant where you, you can eat all day long. It was made for workers going out of the factory for lunch, and they had to eat quickly. So they created the Bouillon, and you can find many Bouillon restaurants in Paris, and this one at Republic is really good. No, 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 no. She told, she told me, can I do something? And she did that. I, I can't accept it. It's a Dora reference. Funny things about Dora the Explorer. In English, she teaches children to speak Spanish. But in French, it's to speak English. Because we are watching it in French. And she said, is it short or long? Is it closed or open? We, we learn English with Dora. That's so bizarre. She has like a cousin called Diego. Yeah, and Diego in French was teaching Spanish. Oh, okay. So this guy was teaching Spanish and Dora was teaching English. So you guys got two languages. And Boots, the monkey from Dora, yeah. in French, he's called Babouche, Babouche. Which is like a shoe from the Arabic uh, countries. So the monkey is Arabic. <laughs> Dora, she's Latina, but she speaks English. Her cousin teach us Spanish when we were like four years old. What is this? What is that? We have the money for the desserts. Tiffany is trying to, to, read, them. to read them with the French accent. Brioche, <laughs> Chantilly. Chantilly. Dora. Hola. We have the desserts. This is the special Easter dessert. It's called an Easter egg, but it's like the egg mayonnaise. So you can see the yolk, the white, and the mayonnaise on top. And it's vanilla cream with lemon curd. And here we have a famous French dessert, the Ile Flottante, Floating Island. So it's bitten egg whites, praline rose, which are pink almond caramelized, crushed on top. And we have the vanilla custard at the bottom. Ooh. And the mix of texture when you put your spoon inside, it's so good. Ile Flottante. Il Flottante. Ile Flottante. It like it literally melts in your mouth, like kind of like um, cotton candy, like it just disappears, it, like disintegrates. My turn, so I'm gonna take all of this with the praline also to have a bit of crunchiness. Let's go. It's a classic of French cuisine and the egg whites are really melting in my mouth. It's like eating a cloud. We need to try this. I really like the idea that it looks like a nut mayonnaise. What did you say? I think somebody recognizes you from behind the other story. <laughs> okay, I think I, I got recognized. Not from YouTube because it's the beginning of this channel, but from Instagram. Yeah, where you should go follow, follow me. Follow me on Instagram. Let's try it. 
Oh, it's a bit Ooh, it's so soft. jelly. It's soft. Oh, it broken. really looks like an egg. Like yeah. you, you can imagine like this is egg white and egg yolk. It's like the same texture. Mm. Okay. Bon appetit. Mm. It really has texture of an egg white, and it's lemony, citrusy. It's really fresh. It's a perfect dessert to end the meal. And all of this costs nothing. Like it's maybe three, like three eighty, three fifty. And maybe three euros. The dessert have the price of an espresso in another cafe. Okay, it's a classic restaurant, but a bit modern. Wait. You can pay the bill with the QR code. 45, 60 euros. I think it's good for oh, we got it. for it's that much. Good. In your usual brasserie, it would cost maybe twice the amount. Yeah. It's not as cheap as I thought, but like the starters and the dessert are really, really cheap. So mm. I can't complain. The problem was the escargot. It costs really expensive for the starter compared to the other one, like where like three or four euros. The escargot were seven. At the end, I paid 21 euros for starter, main course, dessert. This is really nice. You can see the restaurant is full right now. It's really popular. Let's go. Look at the, Look at that. It's the outfit. Party at the top, business in the bottom. Let's go. How was your meal? Oh my god, I feel so full. It's so good. It was really good. For only 20 bucks each. I paid like almost 20 bucks just for the snails before. Mm. You already paid 20 bucks for snails. Bouillon Republic, mm. it's validé. It's really good. Yeah. It's good, it's cheap, and it's not like... Uh, bad quality so i'm really happy about it honestly it was so yummy so <laughs> <laughs> so if you want to explore paris and discover the french way of life don't forget to follow and see you tomorrow i post every day